on pousse encore les limites. On va être ensemble jusqu'à 19h, puis jusqu'à 19h30. Et puis là, on s'est dit, allez, pourquoi pas, c'est au pop-up. Ça arrive qu'une fois euh, par an, donc autant prendre l'antenne jusqu'au bout de la soirée. Et toi, tu as pris le train très tôt ce matin. Ah donc oui. je pense que tu commences à être très légèrement fatigué, un Océane. Un petit peu, ça pique un petit peu. Ça pique un petit <rire> peu, mais tu es plus que ravi d'accueillir sur ce plateau des chiens. Tout à fait. Donc euh, j'interview donc des choses qui nous viennent de Londres. Donc on va avoir une petite interview en anglais, français, gentiment traduit <rire> par Gabin. <rire> Oui, je suis là pour ça, pour la traduction. J'assurerai la partie française de la traduction. On est en très, très, très bonne compagnie. Uh, welcome to France and welcome to Orléans. So, for our auditors, can you um, introduce yourself a bit? Like, uh, uh, your, your band, where you're from, where did you met, uh, how many of you are on the scene? Uh, scene. Uh, je m'appelle Liam. You can do it in English. Yeah, yeah. yeah. English. he's translating it. Yeah. <laughs> so it's a good try, though. It's a good start, though. Yeah, and um, <laughs> je m'appelle Lies. What? We're on our way. <laughs> oui, oui, comme yeah. ça. And uh, we are two of the four members of Decius from London. And we met initially making Fat White Family Records because, you know, me and Luke and Decius are the producers of the Fat White Family Records and Lies is in the band. Yeah. So, yeah. So, yeah. The, Long other, time the, ago. the fourth, the, the fourth member is Quinn from from Paranoid London. So we're like a super group. Mm. Yeah. yeah, other people call us that. We feel a bit pretentious calling ourselves that. Ah. Doesn't matter. Yeah. Sorry. Donc euh, ils sont <coughs> ils sont deux. Euh, J'ai pas besoin de vous traduire. Ils sont deux présents sur le sur le studio et leur groupe est composé de quatre. Donc c'est Dissius, c'est des anciens euh, qui faisaient partie euh, de du label Fat, Mat Fami de Fat White Family que vous peut-être connaissez peut-être. Et euh, le quatrième membre du groupe fait partie de Paranoid Records et ils sont basés à Londres. So, as someone who really likes dancing, I, I quite enjoy the listening to your tracks that made me want to dance a bit so I will be having the occasion tonight. Um, I noticed you seem to use a lot of drum machines and TV303. Uh, do you compose your music in full analogic or more on um, uh, digital plugins? It's mostly analog but you know we do use digital to you know mess around with it but yeah we like old machines and mm. things that are quite simple and a bit you know, dirty sounding, mm. not really clean, you know. Um, yeah, we, we, we kind of got a sick of digital because there's too many, too many possibilities and you end up, mm. you know, oh, I could do this, I could do that. Whereas mm. if you use just the simple things, it just, I don't know, you just, it's, you don't get stuck. Mm. So yeah, and it's more, it's more fun, you know, and most of the music we make with decent, these are staff as a, as jams, you know, where okay. we just we just get something going and see what happens, mm. and then this sort of verbally jams, you know, okay. pretty much. So. Donc la question euh, posée sur euh, quelle forme de batterie, quelle forme de musique ils aimaient euh, faire, euh, ils composaient sur euh, des machines, pas mal et. Euh, donc ils nous ont répondu que c'était sur ils adoraient l'analogue l'analogique en tout cas parce que l'analogique il y avait quelque chose d'un peu sale d'un peu d'un peu un peu plus simple et dans les plugins dans les plugins numériques en fait on peut tout faire on n'a quasiment aucune limite et finalement en fait ce qu'ils trouvent sympa c'est quand même d'avoir un peu de contraintes et euh, le côté organique est très important dans la musique mm. So yeah, that, that was quite linked to my next question about the process of uh, creating music. Do you prefer, so you prefer jamming than arranging, if I understand well? Well, I don't really do anything but jam. And then they uh, arrange in my absence. Yeah, like post-arranging. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You know, no, no ideas that are sort of like fixed in anyone's mm. mind or compo like composing, really. It's just... Yeah. We stay know, away just from kind that. of yeah, just mm. try and fluid. Yeah, not no no thinking allowed. Okay, yeah. you yeah. go with the flow. Yeah. Mm. It's pure yeah. hips. Okay. No yeah. no no <laughs> head 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 is bad. Hips yeah. is good. We did enough of that, didn't we? Yeah yeah yeah, 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 yeah. Too yeah. much head stuff. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so yeah, so we're like right enough of that. Yeah. Just put the brain, mm. put the brain somewhere else, or the parts of the brain. Yeah. 
Oui, euh, un aspect très important de la musique, c'est les jams, c'est les improvisations. On peut dire que un des deux membres de groupe qu'on reçoit fait uniquement des jams, mais en fait, le reste <coughs> du groupe se concentre pour arranger tout ça sans trop modifier. Et euh, en fait, on peut dire que c'est une musique qui n'est pas, euh, pas très cérébrale. Ils ne sont pas là pour réfléchir, ils sont là pour sortir quelque chose de leur trip, quelque chose de réel. Euh, c'est de l'improvisation, tout simplement. Mm. So you were talking about this hip energy. Um, and I noticed uh, in your video clips and also in the way you were moaning or imitating animal screams in your in your tracks that you were um, uh, using this type of animal energy in your music. Uh, and also I, I found it quite amusing that you were... I, I had this feeling that you were like kind of trying to morph into something else Uh, in the process of like singing or m wearing makeup or showing a lot of skin on the video clips and there is something like very organic like this in the what I feel uh, when yeah. I, I watch your your work um, how do you think this type of um, uh, creative process helps you innovate and, and create new things I think for me it's a lot to do with like Muslim guilt you know a lot to offload, you know, okay. to get off my chest, you know. These parameters are very new for me, you know, and you knock one down and then there's another one. But for me, it's about subjection, mm. my, my will towards subjection. That's the theme for me, you know. Why do I want to be punished, you know, and for how long and by, by who, you know. That's what it's about for me. In, in the process of making your music? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah, all of it, yeah. That's what the project. What do you mean exactly by subjecting yourself like to uh, others? Well, you know, you it's some people like to inflict pain and mm -hmm. other people, they like to receive it, you mm -hmm. know? And I think there's usually a bit of both in most people, you know? Mm. I think I have a little bit of both in me, but this is towards one side, I think, you know? I think this is about taking a good, mm. firm pummeling, you know? I feel that way about that kind of hard dance music, you know? Okay. It's like a beating, you know? It's like giving your soul a wash. Oh, so know? there is like a tension in, in this music making you're trying yeah. to... Yeah, something like, like that. Like a power, something around power or... Yeah, okay. and a lack of power, you know? Okay. An abandonment of that power, you know, I think, is where it's... That's where I feel I get my kicks out of it anyway. Submission. Submission. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Good old submission. <laughs> Good luck. Oui. <laughs> mais, tr mais très bien. L'intérêt était de savoir euh, que, que d'où venait cette euh, volonté de se changer, de changer de forme dans les clips, d'avoir différentes formes, euh, d'être un peu mouvant. Euh, D'après les personnes présentes autour de la table, donc euh, d'être euh, la volonté première, c'est en fait euh, de se décharger un poids en se subjectivant, c'est-à-dire en vouloir être puni. Après, par qui, par quoi, euh, on ne sait pas, eux, ils ne savent pas, ils cherchent toujours la question, mais ils veulent recevoir la douleur. Ils pensent qu'on peut avoir les deux côtés, infliger de la douleur ou recevoir de la douleur, mais ils aiment vraiment euh, recevoir la douleur, ça les fait kiffer, ils aiment bien ça, et on va voir ça ce soir. So, um, yeah, I, well, actually, I, I'm coming to the end of the um, interview. Um, so, tonight, after tonight, when are you on tour? When or where will be your next, uh, um, your next performance? Tomorrow we're in, um, we're in Lyon for a festival. I can't remember the name. Um, it's a big, it's a big, it's a good, it's a big it's a one. It's a good, good festival. And really. um, yeah. then we have some, some, random shows around some some ah you know what i don't think i don't think i can announce them we have some really really special shows coming up mm -hmm. um, yeah. well they've announced the belfast one. Oh yeah the well some shows in the uk one with, in, with david holmes club um in belfast in um in a uh, halloween weekend and then one in the north of england which is a place called the golden lion which everybody wants to play. It's really small, but it's really cool. And and then, the, the yeah, the ones coming up after that, we they're not announced yet. They're so secret. we can't say, but they're very, very special. Mm. Okay. Very, very cool. Yeah, some really good stuff coming up. 
Et donc les prochaines dates, euh, demain, ils vont à Lyon pour un festival qui est plutôt sympa d'après eux et qui est assez gros. Euh, sinon, il y a quelques shows un peu spéciales, un peu, un peu random, qui ne peuvent pas trop annoncer, qui ne sont pas encore annoncés, mais ça va être vraiment spécial et ils nous encouragent à, à regarder, j'imagine, euh, ce qui va se passer. Sinon, ils vont aller à Belfast, euh, dans la boîte de David Holmes, si j'ai bien compris, et dans le nord de l'Angleterre également. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thanks for <laughs> um, so yeah, you can go and see dishes tonight at Saint Evêché from uh, 10:30 p.m. to 11:30 p.m. Yeah, come and submit. <laughs> submit with us. Dance. <laughs> and Feel the over. power. Yeah. Yeah. Hand it <laughs> over. With your hips. Hand it over. <laughs> Feel this hip energy. Thank you very much It's and have a great night. Thank great you. performance. Thank you. <laughs>